What's up everybody, it's Jay here, and I have a little special video for you, something like huge, but, um, sorry if you hear a dog in the background, you know, this dog down the street loves to bark when I want to record things, so, um, anyways, I, a few months back, actually more than a few months, I think it's been over half of a year, um, I asked the Sims community what the Sims 4 font was because he seemed to know and it was really agitating me that I didn't have it so I was like I'll ask him because he seems to have it so boom I did and don't mind my rabbit I got the font anyways from him well he told me the name of it and if you go google it and all that stuff it'll pop up but I'm pretty sure none of us can get it okay so um this is the Sims 4 font right here. This right, okay. So if you click the link in the description, it'll take you to my Dropbox, which there's nothing in there, so you can go ahead and whatever. And you download it, um, and it's downloaded, okay. And then you can extract here, you know, all that mumbo jumbo, and um, like highlight them all and install. Right? We all know how to do that, don't we? I think so okay um yeah this is this is an intro that um what is his name shoot i'm horrible with names like what the what the freak is life hold on i'm I'm going on twitter because i'm just gonna be like this is an intro that i can't remember his name so bye um romer Ra is it romer romer john he made it for me so he's awesome thanks I forgot to take it off my thing so you guys couldn't see it, but it, that's not important. So anyways, I use Photoshop. I don't know what you use. I don't know what you use, okay? And so this is their font. And I'm going to tell you now, I'm just going to say it now, that this M does not exist in the font that I'm giving you. And the E isn't like this. My, um, my guess is, my assumption is, is that they use this font it's called Pluto Sans they use it but they mix it with something else or they created this themselves the E and the M and obviously they did this part themselves but once you see the font which I'll which I'll do in a second you'll see that all the letters are the same except the M and that E which I don't use lo it in lowercase because it doesn't look good it doesn't look like the Sims 4 stuff so um yeah so you go you find it you don't go here you go here but you don't want to do regular you want to do bold I don't know what it would look like if it was heavy, but I go bold because that's what the Sims community told me is. He said it's Pluto Sans bold. So that's what I do. And we'll just type in my name and it looks like the Sims font. Um, there you go. The S is the same The four. Everything's the same. The only thing that's different is the M, like I said, and the lowercase E doesn't look like that, but who cares? Really, when you're typing with this font, you should probably be using uh, it in capital because it looks better, in my opinion, in capitals. Um, what else? I just want to see something because I haven't tried it. Oh, it looks it looks even co kind of cooler and heavy. Uh, I'll keep it that. And then obviously you can go and you can do gradients in um, if you use Photoshop, and you know you can find the color, the exact colors, and get it in there if that's what you choose to do. If not, that's cool. No, nobody cares really. Um, and that's how I did it for my Sims 4 icons. If you see, I only have two, so if you go back and look, you can see them. Um, it, it basically looks almost identical obviously not 100% identical because I can't get the M but this is the closest I think we're gonna get for now and so someone can actually release the exact recipe I heard someone did but on Photoshop I don't really think you can mix all those fonts together at least I don't know how so this is what I use um, I wanted everybody to be able to have it since only a select few have it. I've only gave it to a handful or two of people. So I just thought, hey, everyone should have it. So the link for this font will be in the description. Um, it's for my Dropbox. So, uh, yeah, you can get it from there. And I hope that helped. Um, so now I hope everybody who, who has their icons or thumbnails and using the Sims 3 font. or Actually, it's the Sims. I think it's the Sims 2 font that people are downloading. Um, I even have it because that's what I used to use back in the day when I first started YouTube. Um, I hope maybe now you guys will want to change. You don't have to. I'm not saying your icons look ugly. I'm just saying now you can get in the real Sims 4 spirit and use the Sims 4 font. And I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, 
So yeah, share this around so people can get this font because I think it's awesome for everybody to have. And please don't go and make another video because that's rude. I did it first. Oh, I sound I sound like Ray J. <laughs> oh, sorry. Um. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um. Like I said, share it so other people can see it because that'd be nice of you. And have a nice day. Later.